So today's video is a 10 minute practice and it's got a little bit of everything. It's got some strong warriors, it's got some forward folds, got some nice hip openers, um, some planks. So it's a nice strong thorough practice. 10 minutes, um, it'll leave you feeling wonderful. Remember it's about the breath, listen to your body, go at your own pace. Just bring that awareness and try it, enjoy it. Let me know how you feel afterwards. Stand nice and tall in your mountain pose. Feel the feet grounding you down to the earth as the top of the head stretches up to the sky. Inhale and reach the arms all the way up. The palms can touch as you exhale. Hinge at the hips, folding forward. Let the head release as the tailbone lifts all the way up. As you inhale, lengthen through the spine. Begin to rise nice and tall at the top. Again, the palms connecting. And again, exhale and fold, gentle and easy. Use the breath. Let the head release and the tailbone rise. Inhale, lengthen through the spine. Take it all the way back up. Palms connect. Exhale. Last time, folding all the way down. Releasing and letting go. Inhale, rise. Find that nice, tall mountain pose at the top of the breath. And as you exhale, take the left leg and draw it all the way up. Feel the, all the strength and power in that right leg. And then exhale the left leg back. Ground it to the earth as you bend into that front leg, step, settling into your warrior. The belly is drawn in, tailbone tucked under. Lift through the chest, feel the energy in your gaze shifting up to the fingertips. Breathe. Mindful breath. As you inhale, release the back heel, soften the knee, all that weight into the front leg. Inhale, take that left knee all the way up. Find your balance, it's okay if you fall out. And when you're ready, exhale the arms and the foot back down to the earth. Again, inhale, reach the arms all the way up, strong mountain pose as you exhale. Take the right knee and lift it up. Find that strength as you balance on the left leg. When you're ready, exhale, take the right foot back. Rotate and plant. Exhale as you melt into that front leg. Belly is in, feel the length through the spine, the lifting of the chest. Feel the strength in this warrior as you ground the pelvis as you lift through the chest. Connect with the breath. And when you're ready, inhale, soften the back knee, step it all the way up once again, finding that balance at the top of the breath. And then exhale, take the arms and the leg back down to the earth. Take a deep breath in, reach the arms up. And as you exhale, find that hinging of the hips as you find your way into the fold. Head releases, tailbone lifts. Inhale long in the spine as you draw it all the way back up. Once again, nice and tall, strong mountain pose. Deep breath in, exhale the arms all the way down to your side. Take the left foot and step it all the way back as you square off those feet making them parallel arms nice and wide inhale the arms up and as you exhale hinge at the hips and begin to fold just let the hands rest where they will as the head releases down inhale long in the spine once again inhale draw it up open through the chest palms connect and again exhale and fold feel the movement stemming from that shifting of the pelvis release the head tailbone rises up Inhale long in the spine, draw it all the way up once again. Palms connecting, gaze is up. Exhale and fold. Maybe just a bit deeper this time. Let the breath support you. And on the inhale, draw it all the way back up. Nice and strong at the top. Exhale the arms out to the side. Rotate that left foot low or down into that left leg, the back leg, nice and strong. Finding warrior two, that left knee is open to the left straight line from fingertip to fingertip. Belly is in, tailbone is tucked under, breath is mindful. Inhale, take the left fingers all the way up to the ceiling, open and breathe into the left side of your body. Feel the breath as you expand through the ribs, through the lungs. And when you're ready, bring it all the way back to the neutral position. Inhale, straighten through the left leg, back to the center, reach the arms all the way up, feet are parallel. 
And when you're ready, exhale, finding warrior two on the other side. Back leg is straight. Front leg nice and low. Steady your gaze over the fingertips. Connect to your breath. Feel the strength of the warrior. When you're ready, inhale. Take the right fingers all the way up to the ceiling. Follow the gaze, still strong in that back leg. Breathe into the right side of your body. And when you're ready, exhale, draw the hands back to their neutral position. Inhale, take the arms up overhead, come back to the center, feet parallel. Exhale as you once again reach all the way out and fold. Let the head release. Let the hands just come to the mat as you settle into the fold for a few breaths. Soften the knees if you need to. The head is released, the tailbone lifted up. Connect to your breath. When you're ready, inhale, look up, lengthen through that spine, then begin to rotate into a lunge, softening into that right leg, then stepping it all the way back into our plank. Lower the knees, let the hips melt down, draw the shoulder blades back and down as you lift the gaze into a modified upward facing dog. Feel the strength in the core as you send it all the way back into downward facing dog. Use the breath, inhale, passing through plank. Again, lower the knees to the floor, draw the shoulder blades back and down, open through the front of your body. Strong in that core, pass through plank, once again into downward facing dog. Move at your own pace, inhale, knees melting, heart opening, shoulder blades pulling back and down. And as you exhale, keep the knees on the floor, send it all the way back into a child's pose. Take this moment to connect with your breath. Relax through the body. Be right here and right now. And as you're ready, extend the arms all the way back out in front. Come first to the hands and the knees and then lift them if you can, finding your plank posture. Work the hands towards the center. Take the left arm and reach it all the way up as you stack the hips into a side plank. You can always lower that bottom knee. The gaze is up for more of a challenge. When you're ready, bring that hand back to the floor. Then take the right arm and reach it up. Stack through the hips. Feel that strength and that length in the core. Gazing up, mindful breath. And when you're ready, take that top hand and slowly bring it all the way back down to your mat. Find that strong plank posture, then let the knees lower back down to the floor, send the hips back, once again finding that child's pose, taking a moment to breathe. Connect with this moment right here and right now, finding that place of knowing. And when you're ready, extend the arms all the way out. Moving on to the hands and knees, then tuck the toes, push it all the way up and back into a downward facing dog. Take the left leg. We'll send it all the way up to the ceiling. Maintain the integrity of downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in as you exhale. Take that knee all the way up between the hands into a pigeon. Let the top of that back foot come to the floor. Open through the chest as you inhale, then exhale, soften down to the earth. Take a few mindful breaths here as you let the hips release. As you allow yourself to be right here and right now. And as you're ready, pressing down into the earth, inhale and rise. Ground those hands to the floor, tuck the back toe, push it up and back. Keep that foot off the floor as you come into that three-legged dog. And then as you're ready, place the foot back to the floor, downward facing dog. From here, take that right foot all the way up and then draw it to the front in between the hands. Ground the hands to the floor, take a deep breath in as you exhale, lower down. Feel the hips release with each breath, allowing yourself to settle in even more. And when you're ready, ground the hands, inhale, lengthen and rise. Press the hands into the earth, tuck that back toe under, push it back up into that three-legged dog. And as you're ready, bring that foot back to the floor. Once again, downward facing dog. 
connecting to your breath, being right here and right now. And looking up between the hands, step the feet forward, look up, and as you exhale, fold, tailbone lifted, head released. Use the breath as you inhale, lengthen through the spine, take it all the way back up, palms connect, gaze up to the sky. Exhale, draw the hands down through the center to your heart. Let the eyes soften. Take a moment, acknowledge how you feel. Allow yourself to be right here and right now. Do you feel stronger? Do you feel fabulous? Do you feel wonderful? I'm willing to bet that you do. That's what yoga is about. That's what it gives us and does for us. Please like this video, share it on Facebook, tweet it to your friends. And if you do have any questions, if you'd like to share anything, please feel free to leave a comment below. Namaste.